new cool gadget let's check it out hi guys and welcome to today's video as you've seen the intro well short one actually we have Sangstray smart glasses which is a brand that is uh, basically dedicated to creating smart audio glasses which connect via Bluetooth to your phone. Now their goal is to provide users, basically us, stylish smart glasses which are uh, light and comfortable to wear and easy to use because other manufacturers that produce speakers and then they want to produce sunglasses to place speakers in sunglasses that's just simply not it. Maybe you'll get the quality of the speakers and everything else but to have and their philosophy behind Sangstra is to have a uh, good audio and nice and comfortable wear so let's check them out now here we have the two Hydeen sunglasses which are quite cool when it comes to design what's it all about let's check out so first of all what you need to know about these sunglasses they aren't uh, standard conventional sunglasses we have a uh, convenience and more comfort when it comes to sunglasses but you still have audio glasses as well they're actually a substitute for headphones and the temples of the glasses are equal to your standard DWS uh, earphones now earbuds especially in-ear and uh, I think I already mentioned in a couple of my other videos that I get some certain pressure inside my ear when I use in-ear uh, earphones now these don't have that kind of issue because the earbuds or in-ear can be some troublesome and irritating these aren't because they don't get inside your ear which for some of you guys might be more convenient while using and this is a really cool uh, idea and uh, let's say a uh, solution now they also have shades and eyewear so shades for outside because you have sunglasses and you have a blue light eyewear now they also offer prescription audio glasses for those that are nearsighted so this is really cool because you don't have to have separated glasses just for you know work and using them on your computer and you can order from them prescription audio glasses which will definitely help you just by having one glasses to use indoor and outdoor and just simply switch the frames now when we're talking about specifications uh, we can simplify it uh, as much as possible so the functions are quite easy to use uh, double tap on the left uh, side on the left temple where the logo is you access the voice uh, phone voice assistant double tap on the right temple you get a possibility to either play pause the music or if you're in a call or you want to answer a call you can connect or hang up the phone call now if you slide the temple you switch the songs that's for the left side for the right side you can adjust the volume and that's that's it it's quite simple to use it they're using Bluetooth 5.1 connection so you don't have to worry about any uh, problems with connectivity and delay is 190 milliseconds which is quite all right they're waterproof with IPX4 certificate which is definitely true and you can actually see that when you place them on your head some screens are actually well the bright and additional light that usually goes directly to your eyes is actually blocked through these sunglasses then we have some details so these are Sangstri 2 Hydeen and when we're talking about the sound and the volume of the temples uh, and basically the sunglasses uh, let's check this out so i'm going to place a microphone next to the uh, sunglasses going to play some music and slowly going to drag the sunglasses out of the perspective of the microphone just so you can hear the audio volume and the level of course and the distance between and how they're actually heard from a perspective of another person standing next to you
volume. Now when we're taking uh, into consideration the design, full black frame around the glasses and on the frames, you have Sanctuary logo on both sides, which is basically an indication where the controls are located. And this gives you really nice, um, let's say, approach, because if you accidentally miss it, you can actually feel the logo, so you actually know where the controls are. At the end of the frames, you have a double S logo right here, so basically some more of a stylish touch, I would say. The speakers are located actually on two locations when we're talking about uh, each frame. So you have one directed directly into your ear and the other one is on top. Now inside the case you get a nice uh, cloth to clean the glasses. You have USB Type-C charging cable which is used for charging the leather case that comes with. Now it's not a standard leather case but it's really cool because it has loads of uh, additional plastic I would say um, protection. Now, when you place the glasses inside and you accidentally place them in some sort of a bag, they get squished or something like that, uh, the glasses will stay safe because there's plastic going all around and you can actually see the connection part for the charging. At the bottom, you have an indication light and you have a USB Type-C connector right here at the bottom. So this is how you charge them quite easily. Now, as I stated, you get a small, I would say, screwdrivers. I would call it a pin where you can easily change your frames and this is really cool because you can attach them to your keychain and then just uh, swap the frames and of course what I stated at the beginning you get those uh, soft and non-slip nose pads which go right here at the bottom well you know where they go so there's that so what's it all about with the uh, gadgets that I usually do here on the channel they are somewhat connected to the tech niche, so I tend to do some sort of a gadget now and then just to show you guys that they're here and you can actually check them out. So these are really cool in terms of comfortability. Now this is really something that you need to know. So here is the thing, right here on, on your ears, basically they're barely uh, felt. And on the nose, when you're not having those uh, rubber uh, parts that uh, actually soft rubber parts that go on your nose and non-slip, of course, uh, you can actually feel the plastic right here uh, from the frames of the glasses. But when you place the rubber part, they actually go a bit higher. And uh, I would say this is more suited for me because I'm just testing it out without those. And even though they're non-slip and even though they're really uh, soft, they will raise the uh, glasses for a couple of millimeters, maybe one or two millimeters, which is quite all right. Now, they're quite easy to place inside the charging box, but you do need to take into consideration the way you fold them inside. So there's only one way to place them. So they connect to the charging box case and uh, attach to the charging port. Now there's a voice uh, activation control because, well, not uh, voice activation from your side. When they're charging, you get some indications about the charging, of course, and as you heard, when you take them out of the case, there's a female voice saying power on. So you get some sort of, um, let's say, voice indication from the glasses, which give you some indication about power on, power off and stuff like that. Now it's quite easy to connect them via Bluetooth. You just go to your uh, smartphone, you go to your Bluetooth settings and search for the SS2 Hayden sunglasses. Quite easy, you basically just have to press on it and it pairs up. That's the whole philosophy behind it. I'm quite fascinated by them because they have uh, thinner frames than usual uh, other smart glasses which do actually add to the um, comfortability of wearing them constantly. So that's really cool. Now, in addition to everything, I'll place the links below for you guys to check out additional information if I might have missed something or skipped something. And of course, where to buy them, because after all, if you're interested, you'll check out the links without a doubt. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hopefully I will see you all next time again. Thanks for watching. 
Bye, bye.